What's up you guys? Welcome to a weekly vlog. This week I'm busy working, working my 9 to 5 life and I just want to share a little bit with you. Hopefully get into having some good times as well. About to go into work so let's get this week started. Hope you guys have a fabulous week and just remember that it's the little things that make life beautiful. So I'm back in the car y'all. It's lunchtime. They did a little nacho day today. Pay my eight dollars, got my nachos, so that's gonna be my lunch. I'm about to eat it really quick. We run to the post office to do some errands. Check back in with you in just a few. So you guys, the day got away from me. I hate when I let it do that, but it definitely did. I forgot to show you my outfit of the day. I'm in this coop, this super cozy vest zips down i like the gold detail i believe it was from macy's a few years back as well as the shirt the skirt months ago as well as the shoes they are from amazon i love that tie up detail hope you can see and then even though they have the tie up detail they actually zip which is nice makes it very convenient so i'm gonna check back in with you guys tomorrow just had to show you my outfit of the day i think it might have been my favorite part of my day it was Okay, so I just got ready. Right now I'm getting ready to go see Jana Creamer. Um, I love her divorce podcast and I feel like she's kind of like my kindred soul. Kind of like the white version of myself. Love her so much. I'm really not even sure what she's going to do tonight if she's singing. Because I know she sings a lot of country music, which I don't know all of her songs. But she does have a few that I really like. And... I, I used to love watching her from One Tree Hill. Does anybody remember? If you know Jana Kramer, drop something down in the comments. So this is what I'm wearing. I decided to just go with some jeans tonight. I put on this blazer that I often wear for work. And with this little kind of like a knitted top underneath. Threw a little makeup on. And a little lip. I think I have the Nicole Makeup by Mario that I'm wearing. And then I'm gonna, I don't know if I can show you these boots. I'm wearing kind of like, you know, boots that zip up, but I love the tie up detail on them. And this is the look, so I'll see you guys later and I'll check back in with you and let you know how it was. So I'm on my way, you guys, now to the Janet Kramer show. Hope it's a good one. Just now leaving the Janet Kramer show and you guys it was so good oh my goodness all of her So you guys, I'm back at home. It's the next day and it's time for me to get this laundry together. Oh my goodness, the laundry is never ending. If laundry is never ending for you, definitely drop something down in the comments. Let me know how you feel about laundry. But it does feel so good once you get everything done. I wish it went this fast. We can hang out on the beach with our free. That amazing in Christmas times will 
be chilling and having a good, good time. So I left the dog park and now I'm trying to get this tree together, put these lights on. You can see you guys, I am just like so not ready for Christmas this year. It came so fast. You could see me playing some music at home, trying to get my groove on. Our Bonnie wants to dance with me too. Definitely having so much fun, even though I'm so late to get my tree and everything together. Are you an early Christmas decorator or are you last minute? Usually I feel like I do everything pretty early, but this year we're also in the process of moving. So you'll probably see this Christmas tree again in our new place. If you followed me for a while, you know that I've been going through a divorce and I'm downsizing to a place that's probably half the size of this. It actually is, I believe about 1500 square feet so um, I'm gonna work on this Christmas tree here and then hopefully I can just put it in a moving truck and take it with me and spend Christmas in my new place so I got some lights going on there I think I need more I'm, I'm doing this ribbon and after I did the ribbon, I realized an easier way to do it would have been to cut it in strips. That's what I've been seeing a lot of people do. Definitely something that I'll probably do next year. You can see me working with this ribbon. You guys do ribbon on your tree. I've done a little bit of ribbon, but never layers like this. I would actually like to do something even more with the ribbon, but <laughs> I ended up um, taking the ribbon all the way off and doing it kind of cascading down. I think I like this a little bit better. But I mean, just remember you guys, Christmas time, you know, it's just about you know, you guys know what it's about. For me, it's about the birth of Jesus Christ and, you know, just being thankful for my family and friends. Merry Christmas, and baby. these little things I do definitely find joy in doing with my family and for my family. And I hope you guys all have a Merry Christmas Santa this year. Santa Claus is packing the presents Making sure you've been behaving okay Every Christmas, honey, yeah. the snowman's dusting off his hat, putting on the show for everybody to give them a smile that lasts another year. Merry Christmas, baby. The snow is laying two feet deep. Now wish upon a falling star so all your secret dreams can come true. There's something that
so I think I'm gonna end the vlog here today. <laughs> Just a tip if you guys are decorating, probably easier to pull everything out at once. I feel like I usually do that, but didn't this time. This coffee ornament is one of my favorite ornaments. Of course, love my coffee. I will see you guys next time. Hope you guys have a blessed week.